Two vaccines are being administered across the country and each week more shipments arrive in the Bay Area. Tonight, a new survey indicates more people are willing to get inoculated. But as KPIX5's Kenny Choi reports, that's still not enough for herd immunity. Like many other states, California is receiving a lot fewer doses than first anticipated. This comes as new polls show there's a lot more convincing to do to get enough people on board. Nearly 2 million Americans have received shots in the arms with the COVID vaccine. They felt like I could finally take a deep breath for the first time since March. It was just such a relief. Valerie Alexander just got inoculated over the weekend. I can understand that maybe if there are people out there that are not in the science community and are not looking at the data the same way, that maybe they are a little hesitant. New polls from Gallup, Kaiser Family Foundation, and the Pew Research Center show people saying that they are likely or certain to take the vaccine have grown from about 50% this summer to now 60%. I think the overall trend is good. I think it took a dip around the summer because of the uh, influence of politics on the messaging around the vaccine. But those numbers are still well short of the 70% vaccination threshold or higher. Many health experts say is necessary for herd immunity to be reached. People get motivated for a few reasons. The first is if they know somebody who's personally gotten the vaccine, if they've seen public figures uh, get the vaccine themselves. State officials have said California is receiving 40% fewer doses than initially anticipated, but expect hundreds of thousands more each week now that two vaccines have been granted emergency use authorization. In his latest briefing, Governor Newsom says that more than 70,000 Californians have gotten vaccinations. The state also plans to regularly update those inoculation numbers on its COVID-19 dashboard. In Greenbrae, Kenny Choi, KPIX5.